if you want to buy um, portable generator, you and you want to power out, power up your electronics. A couple of things to note is you need to be aware of how the current output is. So if you are familiar with the AC voltage and the sine wave that comes with it, you want the least distortion in it. Otherwise, your equipment will not function properly. The electronics, uh, especially if you have TV and if you have computers, those will, uh, you don't want to get uh, a bad sine wave on the AC. And most of the cheaper generators do provide um, those with a bad um, AC current. So the way to measure it is, they call it THD, and this one is much below uh, on the lower end of the THD. That is the total harmonic distortion. So if you search for it, uh, you will find that these units have a really good alternator, and I will show you what that means. Here is a rigid alternator, and see the size of it. It's very heavy, this unit, is almost 180 pounds. So that being said, why did I buy this unit? I had a different unit, and that, though that was a 3200 uh, running watts, but the, my electronic was not running well on that. So I did some research, and these units gave me less than four THD. And if you, um, are not familiar with it, check the THD and see how the distortion is. If it's more than six on the THD scale, you don't want to use it for home electronics or any electronics for this matter. If you have any comments or questions on this generator, uh, you can uh, write your comments um, on this video and uh, I will respond to that. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see the other videos on how I hook it up.